What's going on, guys? Here we are another week at the Home Theater Hobbyist, and we wanted to give you our initial thoughts on this bad boy, the Shoe Research VTF-2 Mark V, or MK5, 12-inch uh, front firing subwoofer. So let's get into it. Okay, for my initial thoughts, we're going to start with the shipping. How the shipping go? It went well. Check out my unboxing video. I've got it linked in the description below. Um, the box showed up great. There wasn't any dent scratches or anything like that. It was very well packed. Shoe did a really good job. I have no issues with that. I'm, I'm actually really proud of it. How does um, next we'll talk about the design? How does it look? It actually looks really good. Uh, looking at the pictures on the Shoe Research product page, what did I think about it? I was like, mm, I don't know. It might not look all that great. But once I got it, in, I was like, wow, it actually does look really good. Um, there's no peeling. Everything is very well maintained. It's just a really, really good box. It's a subwoofer. It's a black box. I mean. I'm sure there's a lot you can do from a design, but I think Shoe spent more of their time and their money on the components on the inside, which is what I'm more concerned about than how it looks, and I actually like the way it looks. So from a look standpoint, I think it looks perfectly fine. Um, I think it looks, I, wouldn't, I don't know if I would say great, because there's definitely other subwoofers that look really good, but I think it looks perfectly fine, and it would blend in with any room decor. It's just a black box. Um, build quality, very, very good, very, very snug. Everything is in there. There's nothing that rattles or anything like that. I think this, I think it's like 65 pounds or so. And I mean, it's, it's hefty, but you can definitely pick it up and move it around in your room. I wouldn't be moving around every day or anything like that, but you can definitely do that. Uh, when you put the grill on into little pegs, it's actually a very snug fit here near these holes. So it feels really good, solid, very well built. Shoe did a really good job there. Um, Next thing I want to talk about is the size. The size is it's large. I mean, it's not it's not small, especially since you've got these two ports here. If this was a totally sealed subwoofer, it'd be much, much smaller. But since you have the two ports down there and ported subs are typically larger than um, sealed subs, it is pretty large. I mean, this is almost the size of a footstool. It's not nearly as comfortable as a footstool, but it's almost the size of a footstool. So if you have size concerns, maybe you want to go with something a little bit smaller. But for anybody with a, a a normal size theater room or a, a theater room, probably be fine. So would I recommend it? Yes, I would actually recommend this sub. Continue to stay tuned. We will be talking about something else next week, maybe the full review for this. I'm not really sure yet, but continue to like, subscribe, comment in the comments section, and I'll check out our other videos, and we'll see you next week.